that it's worth and valuable. It's valuable. Yeah. 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 What, what it does for them, you know, that you give people information, but it, what, what it does for them is more important than how the art was done, you know. This is yeah. what they want. And I, there, there are little things, I mean, Maria does this a lot. She'll say, well, everybody's doing this. Well, everybody isn't, but it's a good word that sounds like everybody, <laughs> everybody isn't. Like, every, Jim, let's go to the party. Everybody's <laughs> going to be there. Well, everybody's not going to be at the party, right? But everybody that means anything, or yeah. everybody that's anybody is going to be there is well, what it implies. And I will share something with you. A lot of my sales are deposits. And you don't really do that as much, but I find you do it too. Because it works for me. Because if they're not committed to the artwork yet, and I know they want it, and they're 90, 95 to 99% there, and they are going to walk, and I know they're going to walk then, they've already filled in the guest sign-in, sign-out sheet, mm -hmm. and I may never see them again. I say, well, what you'll want to do is um, secure the artwork. You take your time to decide on it, but and then I do the everybody's doing it thing. I say, everybody, <laughs> I do. That's Every, what teenagers do. Everybody. Almost everybody <laughs> walking the gallery is from some other place, mm -hmm. a long ways away, and so you probably do need to measure. You probably do need to make sure it's right for you, but you won't want to leave it on the wall because somebody else might come and feel this way about it and whatever. Jim and then once to, they Jim, make that commitment, Jim used to object to you that. You got him. I still object if it's not genuine. She's if you have to, I use percentage. I yeah. say if you're 95, mm, that's the way 90 to 95 percent mm -hmm. there with it, and mm -hmm. you just need to get comfortable, then we should not leave it on the wall. Right. And then I use the everybody. Thing. And how much do you generally take as a deposit? Always 25 percent, unless it's a commission, then 50. But I just say what the gallery requires is 25 percent down. That's your commitment and their commitment to taking it off the wall for you. Mm -hmm. And then I keep selling it. So you still have time to make sure it's going to happen for yeah, sure. Well, I, sometimes they you don't want to just take the deposit and run. Yeah, why don't you just go ahead they and They have you pay it in full right a, lot. Yeah. Yeah. a lot of times. But that's a soft way to get people to say, to commit. Right. And, and one thing that does is it takes the discount out of the picture. Mm -hmm. That's why I like it. Because you don't get to negotiating. You get to secure it. That's mm -hmm. the conversation. And so they're, they're putting deposit down, and then they're paying the balance. Mm -hmm. So the negotiation's out of the picture. Um, How do you get people in the viewing room? You just follow me. you got, you got to see something. Well, You've got to see this. I don't go too fast. You've got to no. see this. Um, because I have that. When I first started with this gallery, I went down behind of the strip. And I was, like, appalled. Mm -hmm. Because I was just walking through there. They didn't know who I was. Obviously, it was me and my sister. But um, I wasn't even, I just barely looked at something that was going off the wall in the room, and I thought, this is like totally insane. So I talk to him, say hi, a little bit of chatting, sure. mm -hmm. find a thing. Then I say, which of your favorite, which is your favorite? I make sure I have the right piece in the viewing room first. Because mm -hmm. if you don't, you're not going to end up with the same. Mm -hmm. Which is your favorite out of the ones you saw? Okay, well, um, I'm going to bring it in here. I don't ask. I'm going to bring it in here so you can see it in the light that it would be in. Maybe in the evening, or early morning, or whatever, and then they follow you. But if you have the wrong piece, yeah, you gotta tell them why there. you're bringing sure. it in. So yeah, I don't just take it off the wall and expect them to, to go like that. Don't it's ask kind them, of would you like to see this in the viewing room? Yeah. No, because they'll say no. No, 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 no. Don't bother. Well, you know, and the other thing you have to realize, especially here on Front Street, is they're getting hammered hard yes. in so. every gallery yeah. on the street. Yeah, and, and they walk so and go, we're just looking. They're, they've oh, already yeah. got their hackles up. And then in our gallery, because it's so big and because this is the style that Jim prefers, is for us to follow them around practically, you know, where they can feel the breath on the back of their neck. Thank you and, very much. You know, <laughs> <laughs> and it's, I mean, Jim, it, it is your, you know, that is your style that you, that it you is, like you us to do. You need to be do. alert and watching yeah. and knowing what Watching them from, a, from I think, a distance. I think you've got to give and people a little bit of a... And it's a different way out, I yeah, think engage and listen, engage. You gotta find this one. Don't have to ask. Greeting people and releasing, the greet and release yeah, is, is release. totally true. Mm -hmm. You greet the people, you're supposed to smile, you're supposed to show your teeth. Yeah, give them a few they say, don't go. Yeah, not yeah, yeah, with Jim. Because then you're not then you're not holding anything. They know they can trust you. He gets results, though. And you energetically stay with them. They don't follow on. I don't ever. We have a large yeah. percentage of people that shoot through this gallery like a tornado, too. Mm -hmm. they have a, we call it the treadmill. <laughs> and that's fine. If it's hard to keep up with them. They're killing time. Yeah. They're probably not really. No. Oh, you know, know what I love? They're, they're running away from us. I love our sales on a timer when they have the restaurant pager. <laughs> and you're oh, just waiting yeah. for that thing to start. Blinking. 
Hey Maria, I got a question. Is it dangerous to sometimes go to a photo file, you know, after they've focused on one sort of artist and then that you, you go through the photos and that, then you're showing them so many things. So Only if you're going to show them one or two things that you know they don't want. Oh, okay. Because I know so people go to the website, they can get lost in that too and go, oh my gosh, look at all this no, stuff. No, too much is not good. I don't okay. hardly ever take the photo file out unless okay. I know there's a few in it or I pull out what I think they want to see because they'll go into confusion. Or you watch them when they give it to you, they start going like this and they want to get rid of it. They're not interested in seeing so much either. Well, and you, you can over-present. I mean, you give them yeah. too many options, yeah. you know. They, I think that Oftentimes, <coughs> when I have someone in the room, I like to take some pieces that I might like to see. And, and so you have choices of what's best. And then, then you do the process of elimination. And, you know, which it, one instead it, of? It, yeah. And, yeah, and yeah, it gives you a, a point of conversation. Which one's your favorite? So let's let's yeah. let's look at the, you know at. Um, and that's really smart. You know, at another yeah. piece to compare it. They used to have the rule of three. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Yeah. And then yeah. and then yeah. as soon as they eliminate something, so I take it out there. of the room. Mm -hmm. And Absolutely. it also gives them a chance to chat amongst themselves. I'll you know I'll, I'll have it in the room and say, of these three pieces, is there one that you yeah. folks would both agree to eliminate? And they'll go, well, I would. You know, get rid of that one, and then him go. Oh yeah, me too. And when you do that, they're yeah. saying they're yes to the one decisions. that they like, yeah. right? And so yeah. I'll, I'll, what I'll usually do is say, "That's great. Let me get it out of here so that it's not distracting." And, it's and I then I take it out of the room, and I find a reason to just think around outside of the room to give them a few seconds mm -hmm. to talk quietly amongst themselves, because they won't make a decision sometimes That's in front true. of you. They'll feel they'll have to leave the gallery. You got to give them some space, mm -hmm. you know, to to, mm -hmm. to do that. So when you can find reasons. Let me go get a photo file. I want to show you one other thing. Mm -hmm. You know, go. Well, also, that slows everything down. Mm -hmm. you know? so, and they stay in there longer if you give them something to look at, like a browse book or whatever. Mm -hmm. The photo file has been my friend. I mean, I've made cells off the photo file because something that I've said a lot is, um, is that we represent so many fantastic artists and we can't hang them all at one time. And if you tell me a little bit of what you're looking for, um, I can show you what we have, and I mean, I've definitely made at least three cells for sure that wasn't even on the wall just because they talked to me a little bit. I knew what they wanted. I was able to show it to them, and it sold. If you, uh, if you have somebody in the dining room and you say, why don't I let you have a little time together and privacy, you close the door and you go out, do you prefer to come back and tap on the door after a period of time, or do you prefer... Mm -hmm. Okay, or do you prefer to wait till they come out? No. I, I agree. Tap. I agree. Like so, don't let them stay in there the forever. Yeah. And they like that. that you, you can if offer. I do shut the door in the viewing room, sometimes like, people feel trapped. I so never what shut I, the door. What I do when I, sh when no, I, I shut like the door shut. is I tell them before I shut the door that I'm going to shut the door. Oh. And I, what I do is I dim the lights a little bit and I, I say, I'm going to close this door just to remove the ambient light. So okay. that you get a better feeling. So they know what you're doing. You know, and then I just slowly close the door. Otherwise, they're like, what is she doing? Oh, shit, she's locking us in. Yeah. 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 Not yeah.